Slava Jesus Christ. Glory be to Jesus Christ. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God of peace and justice, we pray for the people of Ukraine today. We pray for peace and the laying down of weapons. We pray for all those who fear for tomorrow, that your spirit of comfort would draw near to them. We pray for those with power over war or peace, for wisdom, discernment, and compassion to guide their decisions. Above all, we pray for all your precious children at risk and in fear that you would hold and protect them. We pray in the name of Jesus, the Prince of Peace. Amen. Glory be to you, our God. Glory be to you. Heavenly King, Advocate, Spirit of Truth, who are everywhere present and fill all things, Treasury of Blessings, Bestower of Life, come and dwell within us. Cleanse us of all that defiles us, and, O good one, save our souls. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Trinity, most holy, have mercy on us. Cleanse us of our sins, O Lord. Pardon our transgressions, O Master. Look upon our weaknesses and heal them, O Holy One, for the sake of your name. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Come, let us bow and worship before the King, our God. Come, let us bow and worship before Christ, the King, our God. Come, let us bow and worship and fall down before the very Lord Jesus Christ, our King and God. I believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father. Light from light, true God from true God, begotten, not made, one in being with the Father. Through him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation he came down from heaven, by the power of the Holy Spirit, he was born of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered, died, and was buried. On the third day, he rose again in fulfillment of the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, with the Father and the Son, he has worshipped and glorified. He has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. I acknowledge one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Glory be to the Father who created us now and forever and ever. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Glory be to the Son who redeemed us, now and forever and ever. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Glory be to the Holy Spirit who sanctifies us and confirms us in the holy Catholic and Orthodox faith now and forever and ever. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection. When the Sabbath was over, Mary Magdalene and Mary, the mother of James, and Salome bought spices so that they might go and anoint him. And very early on the first day of the week, when the sun had risen, they went to the tomb. They had been saying to one another, Who will roll away the stone for us from the entrance to the tomb? When they looked up, they saw that they, the stone, which was very large, had already been rolled back. 
As they entered the tomb, they saw a young man dressed in a white robe sitting on the right side, and they were alarmed. But he said to them, Do not be alarmed. You are looking for Jesus of Nazareth, who was crucified. He has been raised. He is not here. Look, there is the place they laid him. But go, tell his disciples and Peter that he is going ahead of you to Galilee. There you will see him, as he told you. We pray for the salvation of souls and the conversion of many. but tepura de la Christas pasa is the vetila dush nasher. Bohorodit se divoradu isha blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu, blaus lavana temijin kame, i blaus lavana pidlonet boho. But tepura de la Christas pasa is the vetila dush nasher. Bohorodit se divoradu isha blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu, blaus lavana temijin kame, i blaus lavana pidlonet boho. But tepura de la Christas pasa is the vetila dush nasher. Bohorodzi divo radrisha, blahodat na Maria, hospits to bore you, blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho, but tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodzi divo radrisha, blahodat na Maria, hospits to bore you, blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho, but tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodzi divo radrisha, blahodat na Maria, hospits to bore you, Blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho, but tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodzi divo radrisha, blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu, blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho, but tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodzi divo radrisha, blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu. Blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho. But tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodit se divo radrisha blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu. Blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho. But tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Bohorodit se divo radrisha blahodat na Maria, hospits to boyu. Blavos lavana temijin kame, e blavos lavana pidlonet boho. But tepura de la Christas passa is bavetila dush nasher. Slava itsui senui shutomo duchovi ineni potrachas ina vike vichni amin. O mi susa prustenam nashi hirike, zberger nasvi pekhen nohovo nu, provide donab of shi dushi o soblevo tisho ne bisha potrubuyut tvoho melosarnia. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. When they had come together, they asked him, Lord, is this the time when you will restore the kingdom to Israel? He replied, It is not for you to know the times or period that the Father has set by his own authority, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. When he had said this, as they were watching, he was lifted up, and a cloud took him out of their sight. While he was going, and they were gazing up toward heaven, suddenly two men in white robes stood by them. They said, Men of Galilee, why do you stand looking up toward heaven? This Jesus, who has been taken up from you into heaven, will come in the same way as you saw him go into heaven. And they worshipped him, and returned to Jerusalem with great joy. And they were continually in the temple, blessing God. We pray for the souls of the departed. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. 
Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. When the day of Pentecost had come, they were all together in one place. And suddenly from heaven there came a sound like the rush of a violent wind, and it filled the entire house where they were sitting. Divided tongues as of fire appeared among them, and a tongue rested on each of them. All of them were filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak in other languages, as the Spirit gave them ability. Now there were devout Jews from every nation under heaven living in Jerusalem. And at this sound, the crowd gathered and was bewildered, because each one heard them speak in the native language of each. But Peter, standing with the eleven, raised his voice and addressed them. Men of Judea and all who live in Jerusalem, let this be known to you and listen to what I say. Jesus of Nazareth, this man you crucified and killed by the hands of those outside the law. This Jesus God raised up, and of that all of us are witnesses. We pray for the faithful witness of all Christians to the world. Klibnas na sušni dainem šehodni i prostenem provene naši, jaki me prošćajmo venevačem našem. I ne vedenes vas pokusu, ale vezbolo nas vidlo kavoho. Amin. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, Blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, Blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. Bohorodici divo raduše, blahodatna Marija, hospod s tvoju, blavoslovene teme žinkame i blavoslovene pidlone tvoho, v te poredela Hrsta spasa izbavetila duš naše. 
Ohorodice Diva Radisha Blahodatna Maria, Hospod Stoboju, Blahoslovena Temežin Kame i Blahoslovena Pidlone Tvoho, bo te poradila Hrsta Spasa i zbavetila duš našer. Ohorodice Diva Radisha Blahodatna Maria, Hospod Stoboju, Blahoslovena Temežin Kame i Blahoslovena Pidlone Tvoho, bo te poradila Hrsta Spasa i zbavetila duš našer. Slava Ecu i Senu i Švetomu Duhovi i Neni povčas čas i na vike vični. Amin. O me Isuse, proste nam naše hrihe, spereže nas vid pekennoho vohnju, provaj do nebo vši duši, osoblevo ti, še najviše potrebuju tvojo milosarnje. The fourth glorious mystery, the dermission of the Theotokos. At your departing, O Virgin Mother of God, to him who was ineffably born of you, James, the first bishop of Jerusalem and brother of the Lord, was there, and so was Peter, the honored leader and chief of the disciples, and the whole sacred fellowship of the apostles. Though dispersed throughout the world, clouds caught the apostles up into the air, and they were brought together to form a single choir before your most pure body. And bearing you with reverence in Gethsemane, they sang aloud the words of Gabriel, Rejoice, O full of grace, O unwedded virgin, the Lord is with you. Entreat your Son and our God to save our souls. Arise, O Lord, into your rest, you and the ark of your holiness. Then God's temple in heaven was opened, and the ark of the covenant was seen within his temple. We pray for good and peaceful death. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. <clears throat> The fifth glorious mystery, the glorification of Mary in heaven and her holy protection. Let us gloriously sing David's song to the young bride, to the mother of Christ our God and the King of all. O Master, the Queen stood at your right hand, clothed in golden robes and adorned with celestial beauty. You have affirmed her, chosen from among women, and deemed to be born of her because of your great mercy. You have given her as a help to your people to build up and protect your servants from all misfortunes, O only blessed one. Let us praise the Immaculate Queen of all, the most pure virgin, the mother of Christ our God, for she always mercifully extends her hands to her son. Let us fervently sing to her, rejoice, O protection, defense, and salvation of our souls. 
We pray for greater devotion to Mary and eternal happiness in heaven. Slava Itzu Isenu Ishvatomu Duchovi Ineni Povtarchas Ina Vike Vichni Amin. O mi Iisus e prasjenem nashi hrihe, sperazhena svi pekhen noho vohnu, provaj do nebo vši duši osoblevo ti, še ne biše potrebujut tvoho milosarnja. We'll end with the Magnificat with Mary, and the initial responses are, Mary, be with me. Mary, with your consent to become the Mother of God, Torrents of grace for, poured forth upon the earth, opening up for me a path to follow. In times of loneliness, Mary, be with me. In times of turmoil and uncertainty, Mary, be with me. In times of grief, loss, or illness, Mary, be with me. In times of sadness or depression, Mary, be with me. In times of lost plans and broken promises, Mary, be with me. When I am anxious about the welfare of my family, Mary, be with me. When a job or financial stress weighs heavily on my heart, Mary, be with me. When I am discouraged by the weight of my sins, Mary, be with me. When I am tempted, Mary, be with me. When I am afraid, Mary, be with me. When the Lord calls me to greater kindness and love, Mary, be with me. When the Lord calls me to greater forgiveness, Mary, be with me. When the Lord calls me to greater purity, Mary, be with me. On the wings of your fiat, Mary, I proclaim mine. Together we sing a Magnificat of praise. And the responses are, I praise you, Jesus. For all the blessings in my life, I praise you, Jesus. For the gift of today, I praise you, Jesus. For the gift of loved ones, I praise you, Jesus. For the gift of my life, I praise you, Jesus. For creating me with a special purpose and plan, I praise you, Jesus. For never giving up on me, I praise you, Jesus. For your infinite love, I praise you, Jesus. For never leaving me, I praise you, Jesus. For your inexhaustible mercy, I praise you, Jesus. For your presence in the Eucharist, I praise you, Jesus. For the greater good you will bring out of everything, especially 
in moments when I feel helpless and vulnerable. I praise you, Jesus. In the midst of uncertainty, I praise you, Jesus. In the midst of humility, I praise you, Jesus. In the midst of difficulty, I praise you, Jesus. In the midst of what appears as failure, I praise you, Jesus. For sending your mother to me in both joyful and sorrowful moments, I praise you, Jesus. With Mary, I sing, the Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend the people of Ukraine in battle. Be their defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and the other evil spirits who prowl throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Прийди і вселися в нас, 
и очисти нас от всякой скверни, и спаси благоженно Божий. Heavenly King, Advocate, Spirit of Truth, who are everywhere present and fill all things, treasury of blessings bestower of life, come and dwell within us, cleanse us of all that defiles us, and, O oh good one, save our souls. Mary, Господи, we pray. Господи, помилуй. Сады высоты за спасение душ наших, Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. За милицу, свету, добрый стан, святой Божий церков. Из еднания всех, Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. За святый храм цей, тех, что с верою, побожностью и страхом Божьим входят у него. Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. За святейшего Вселенского Архирея нашего Франциска Папу Римского, Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. За блаженнейшего Патриарха нашего Святослава, за преосвященнейшего митрополита нашего Кирилла Брентия и за болюбиво епископа нашего Кирдовида, честное пресвитерство, Христи Диаконство, за весь причете людей, Господи, ви помонимся. Господи, помилуй. За Богом дорожений народ наш, за правління і за все військо, Господи, ви помонимся. Господи, помилуй. За місто це і за кожне місто, країну і за тих, що вірю, живуть в них, Господи, ви помонимся. Господи, помилуй. За добре поліття, за врожай плодів земних і часи мирні, Господи, ви помонимся. Господи, помилуй! За тих, що плавають, подорожують, за недужих, страждаючих, полонених і за спасіння їх, Господи, ви помолімся! Господи, помилуй! For the servant of God, Teresa Wilk, and for her blessed memory, and for the forgiveness of all her offenses, voluntary and involuntary, Господи, ви помолімся! Господи, помилуй! That she may stand blameless before the awesome tribunal of Christ and may gain entry into the land of the living, the place of light where all the just repose. Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. Щоб визволити сей нам від усякої скорби, гніву, піде і нужди. Господи, ви помолимся. Господи, помилуй. Заступи, спаси, помилуй. И охрани нас, Боже, Твоею благодатью. Господи, помилуй. Пресвяту, пречесту, преблагословенну, славну владичицу нашу Богородицю и пресну Диву Марию, с усима святыми помянувши, сами себе и один одно, и все життя наше. Христу Богу вибитаемо. Тоби, Господи. Should be fit you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. The heavens tell the glory of God, and the firmament declares the work of His hand. Through the prayers of the Mother of God, O Savior, save us. Day to day pours forth the message. And night proclaims this knowledge to night through the prayers of the Mother of God. O Savior, save us. Their utterance has gone forth into all the earth and their words into the ends of the world through the prayers of the Mother of God. O Savior, save us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Only begotten Son and Word of God, you are immortal, and you will for our salvation to be made flesh of the Holy Mother of God 
and ever Virgin Mary, and without change you became man. You were crucified, O Christ our God, and trampled death by death. You are one of the Holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit. Save us. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help and save, have mercy and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Remembering our most holy and immaculate, most blessed and glorious Lady, the Mother of God and ever Virgin Mary, together with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our God. To you, O Lord. You have given us the grace to pray together in harmony, and I promise to grant the request of two or three who join their voices in your name. Fulfill now for us, your servants, these petitions for our benefit. Grant us in this present life the knowledge of your truth, and in the age to come bestow eternal life. For you are a good and loving God, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Come, let us sing joyfully to the Lord. Come, let us acclaim God our Savior. O good advocate, save us who sing to you. Alleluia. Let us come before his face with praise and acclaim him in psalms. O good advocate, save us who sing to you, alleluia. For God is the great Lord and the great King over all the earth. O good advocate, save us who sing to you, alleluia. Wisdom must stand arise. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ. O good, good advocate, advocate, save us who sing to you. Alleluia. Blessed are you, O Christ, our God, who revealed the fishermen as most wise by sending them the Holy Spirit. Through them you caught the entire world. Loving Master, glory to you. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. When the Most High descended and confused the tongues, he parted the nations. He called all to unity. And with one voice, we glorify the All-Holy Spirit. Amen. Sviahati Boja, Sviahati Kripke, Sviahati Baza Smartni Pomi Luinas, Sviahati Boja, Sviahati Kripke, Sviahati Baza Smartni Pomi Sviahati Boja, Sviahati Kripki, Sviahati Baza Smartni Pomiluj nas. Slavu Tiu i Synu i Svjetomu Duhovi, i neni po vsek čas i na vike vični. Amin. Sviahati Baza Smartni Pomiluj nas. Sviahati Boža, Sviahati Kripki, Sviahati Baza Smartni Pomiluj nas. 
Let us be attentive. Peace be with all wisdom. Let us be attentive. The Perkimenon in the eighth tone. Their utterance has gone forth into all the earth and their words unto the ends of the world. Their utterance has gone forth into all the earth and their words unto the ends of the world. The heavens tell the glory of God and the firmament declares the work of his hand. Their utterance has gone forth into all the earth, and their words unto the ends of the world. Their utterance has gone forth into all the earth, and their words unto the ends of the world. Let us be attentive. Peace be with all wisdom, let us be attentive. A reading from the epistle of the Holy Apostle Paul to the Romans. Let us be attentive. Brothers and sisters, grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. First, I thank my God through Jesus Christ for you all that your faith is spoken of throughout the whole world. For God is my witness, whom I serve with my spirit in the gospel of his Son, that without ceasing I make mention of you always in my prayers, making request if, by some means, now at last I may find a way in the will of God to come to you. For I long to see you, that I may impart to you some spiritual gift, so that you may be established that is, that I may be encouraged together with you by the mutual faith, both of you and me. Peace be to you, reader. Wisdom, let us be attentive. Alleluia, alleluia. By the Lord's words the heavens were established, and by the breath of his mouth all their host. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord has looked down from heaven, and behold the whole human race. Alleluia. By the Lord's words the heavens were established, and by the breath of his mouth all their host. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Wisdom, stand to right. Let us listen to the Holy Gospel. Peace. Be with all and with your spirit. spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory be to you, O Lord, glory be to you. Let us be attentive. At that time, the Lord said, Give to him who asks you, and from him who wants to borrow from you, do not turn away. You have heard that it was said, You shall love your neighbor and hate your enemy. But I say to you, love your enemies, bless those who curse you, do good to those who hate you, and pray for those who spitefully use you and persecute you, that you may be sons of your Father in heaven. For he makes his sun rise on the evil and on the good, and sends rain on the just and on the unjust. For if you love those who love you, what reward have you? Do not even tax collectors do the same? And if you greet your brethren only, 
What do you do more than others? Do not even the tax collectors do so? Therefore you shall be perfect, just as your Father in heaven is perfect. Glory be to you, O oh Lord, glory be to you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Glory be to Jesus Christ, and welcome this morning. The commandment to love one's neighbor is based on Leviticus chapter 19, verse 18. And we read there, it says, You shall not take vengeance, nor bear any grudge against the children of your people, but you shall love your neighbor as yourself. I am the Lord. It's Leviticus chapter 19, verse 18. So the Old Testament did not teach to hate one's enemies, but it was a commonly held interpretation of this verse that you love your own people and hate the sinners and the pagans. So it's not in Scripture. Uh, the Old Testament never taught to teach, uh, never taught to hate one's enemies. Again, it's an interpretation of Israel. So Jesus points out that loving only those who are around us or like us or, or love us, it's no different than from tax collectors and what pagans do. And so Jesus commands his disciples and all of us to love our enemies and pray for those who persecute you and who hate you. Jesus calls his disciples to imitate God by being perfect in love. So genuine love is not tainted by anger or hatred or lust. It remains committed. It remains committed to one's personal word, one's promises, and it remains committed in the sacrament of marriage. Jesus therefore calls his disciples to reflect the Father's perfection, to be like the Father, perfect, committed, selfless, and merciful, and loving in our own lives. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Господи, помилуй. Господи, вседержителю Божий, отці в наших молимось, тобі вислухай і помилуй. Господи, помилуй. Помилуй нас, Боже, з великої милості Твоєї, молимось, тобі вислухай і помилуй. Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. О, Господи, помилуй. Ще молимо за святійшу Вселенську архірію нашу, Франциска, Папу Римську, за блаженнішу патріарха нашу, Святослава, за преосвященнішу митрополита нашу, Кіла Врентя, боголюбиву єпископа нашу, Кір Давила, за тих, що служать і послужили у святому храмі цьому, за отців наших духовних і всіх у Христі, братів наших. О, Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. О, Господи, помилуй. Ще молимось за Богом, бережений народ наш, за правління і за все військо. О, Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. О, Господи, помилуй. We also pray for the repose of the soul of the servant of God, Teresa Wilk, who has fallen asleep for the forgiveness of her offenses, voluntary and involuntary, that the Lord God may place her soul where all the just repose. This look in us, Господи, помилуй. О, Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. 
Господи, помилуй. We continue to pray for Ukraine, the nation of Ukraine and its armed forces, for a quick and swift victory over all enemies visible and invisible, for an end to this war, a restoration of peace and harmony, that Ukraine may rise in victory. Веслухай нас, Господи, і помилуй. Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. O merciful Master and Lover of Mankind, look upon your servants, Catherine and Justin, and hear our prayers offered in faith for you yourself. Said whatever you ask in prayer, believe that you will receive it, and ask and you shall receive. Because of this, although we're unworthy of your gifts, we trust in your mercy. Grant your blessings to your servant, Catherine and Justin. Fulfill their good intentions. Preserve them for the rest of their days in peace and in health. Hasten to hear us. Vislukai nas hospode i pomilu. Hospode pomiluj, hospode pomiluj. Hospode pomiluj. We also pray for the people here present this morning who await your great and bountiful mercies for those who have been kind to us. Изо всіх православних християн. Господи, помилуй, Господи, помилуй. Господи, помилуй. For you are a merciful and loving God, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Again and again. Peace, let the faithful pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Wisdom, so that always protected by your might, we may give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Represent the cherubim. Represent the cherubim. And sing the thrice holy hymn to. Now lay aside all cares of life. Now lay aside, lay aside all cares of life. And sing the thrice holy hymn to the life-giving Trinity, to the life-giving Trinity. Now. Now lay 
Remember in his kingdom, our most holy universal pontiff, Francis, Pope of Rome, his beatitude, our patriarchs at the slum, our most reverend metropolitan Lawrence, our God-loving Bishop David, all the priestly, diaconal, and religious orders, our nation under God, our government, and all the military, the noble and ever-to-be-remembered founders and benefactors of this holy church. And may the Lord God remember in his kingdom all you Orthodox Christians, now always and forever and ever. Amen. That we may receive the King the of Joseph all, took down escorted the invisibly, by ranks of angels, alleluia, 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 alleluia. Spawni molitvu nasu, Hospode vi. Hospode pomi. Господи, Ты принимаешь жертву хваления в тех, что призывают тебя всем сердцем. Прими моления и нас грешных, принеси до святого твоего жертвника. И в чине нас датными приносить тебе дари жертвы духовные за наши грехи и людские невидения. И сподоби нас найти благодать перед тобою, чтобы была тебе приемна жертва наша. Та, что вселился дух благодати и твои благи у нас и на всех дарах, что перед нами и на всех людях твоих. Щедротим єдинородного Сина Твого, що з ним благословенний єси з пресвятим і благим і животворним Твоїм Духом, нині повсяк час і навіки вічні. Амінь. Мир і всі. І духові Твоєму. Позлюбимо один одно, щоб однодумно визнавати. Отця і Сина, і Святого Духа, Троїцю єдиносушну і нероздільну. I believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. I believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father, light from light, true God from true God, begotten, not made, one in being with the Father. Through him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation he came down from heaven. By the power of the Holy Spirit he was born of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered, died, and was buried. On the third day he rose again in fulfillment of the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father. With the Father and the Son, he is worshipped and glorified. He has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. I acknowledge one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Let us stand well. Let us stand with fear. Let us be attentive to offer in peace the holy oblation. The mercy of peace, the sacrifice of praise. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the Father, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit 
be with all of you and with your spirit. Let us lift up our hearts. We have lifted them to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord. It is right it is and just, just to worship to the Father the and the Son and the Holy Spirit, Spirit. Existing the Trinity, the Son, one in being, and undivided. For all this we give thanks to you, to your only begotten Son and to your Holy Spirit. For all things which we know and do not know, the benefits bestowed upon us both manifest and hidden. We thank you also for this liturgy, which have deigned to accept from our hands. Even though there stand before you thousands of archangels and tens of thousands of angels, the cherubim and the seraphim, sixth-winged and many-eyed, hovering aloft on their wings, singing, crying, exclaiming, and saying, the triumphal hymn. Holy, holy, holy Lord of Sabbath, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the Or rather gave himself for the life of the world. He took bread into his holy, most pure, and immaculate hands. Gave thanks, blessed, sanctified, and broken. He gave it to his holy disciples and apostles, saying, Take it. This is my body, which is broken for you, for the forgiveness of sin. Drink of it, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, which is poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Remembering therefore this hour, and all that is done for us, the cross, the tomb, the resurrection on the third day, the ascension into heaven, the sitting at the right hand, and the second and glorious coming. We offer to you, yours of your own, in behalf of all and for all. We sing Shall of we you, we bless you, we thank you, O Lord, and we pray to you, our God. Here present and make this bread the precious body of your Christ, and that which is in this chalice the precious blood of your Christ, changing them by your Holy Spirit. So that they may be for communicants, sobriety of soul. Forgiveness of sins, fellowship of your Holy Spirit, fulfillment of the kingdom of heaven, confidence before you, not for judgment or condemnation. Further, we offer you this rational and unbloody worship for those who have gone to their rest in faith, forefathers, fathers, patriarchs, prophets, apostles, preachers, evangelists, martyrs, confessors, ascetics, and for every righteous soul that finished this life in faith. Especially for our most holy and immaculate, most blessed and glorious lady, the Mother of God and ever Virgin Mary. O my soul, magnify the one divinity in three persons. Rejoice, O Queen. Tongue, though Kai 
capable and eloquent can not him you as is your due and every mind is confounded in seeking to comprehend the way in which you gave birth wherefore Among the first, remember, O Lord, our most holy universal pontiff, Francis, Pope of Rome, our most blessed patriarch, Sotoslao, our most reverend metropolitan, Lawrence, our God-loving bishop, David, for the sake of your holy churches, grant that they may live in peace, safety, honor, and health for many years, and rightly impart the word of your truth. And remember all men and all women. Amen. Zusima vami iz duhom tvojih. Si svijete ih pomjenuši šešte, v meni, Gospode, vi pomolim se. O, Gospode, pomeluj. Za prenesenje osvjačenje česni dare, Gospode, vi pomolim se. O, Gospode, pomeluj. Šam čuvalika ljudi. Prenjavši ih u svijete i nadnebesni duhovni svi žrtovnik, jak primni zapak duhovni, zi slav nam božanstveno blagodat i dar svjetovo duha, pomolim se. O, Gospode, pomilu. Šom ne zvoliti se nam i do vsjakoj skorbi, njivu bide i nužde, Gospode, vi pomolim se. O, Gospode, pomilu. Zastupe, spase, pomiluj, okroni nas, Bože, Tvojeju blagodatju. O, Gospode, pomiluj. Dnjaco, doskonalo, svjeto, mirno i bezrišno, Gospoda, prosim. O, daj, Gospode. Amnjela, miru, vjerno nastavnika, okronca, dušitelj naših, Gospoda, prosim. O, daj, Gospode. Prošenja i vidpošenja hrikiv i prorišen naših, Gospoda, prosim. O, daj, Gospode. Dobro i požedno očno dla duš naših i meru dla svitu, Gospoda, prosim. Podaj, Gospode. Ostane čašnika našo, meri pokajanje skinčete, Gospoda, prosim. Podaj, Gospode. Hristijansko i končine žitja našo, bez bolizno i bez dohanu i mirno i i dobro odvitu na strašnom osudji Hristovom uprosim. O, daj, Gospode. Jedni zbiri prečase svedo duha vyprosivši, sami sebe judenotno i vse žitja naše, Hristu Bovi bit dajmo. To vi, Gospode. Ispodobe nas, Vlade, kozi smilevistju, neosudno smijte prezivati Tebe, nebesno, Boga, Otca i Movite. Otče naš, što je Sin na nebesah, nehaj svjetice imja Tvoje, nehaj prejde carstvo Tvoje, nehaj bude volja Tvoja, jak na nebi, tak i na zemlji. Hlib naš nasušni, daj nam sjohodni i prosti nam provini naši, jak i me proščajemo venovacijem našem. I ne vede nas uz pokusu, ale vezvole nas vid lukavoho. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
and lead, lead us not, not into temptation, temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Peace be with all. And with your spirit. Bow your heads to the Lord. To you, O Lord. We give you thanks, O invisible King, for by your infinite power you created all things, and in your great mercy you brought all things from nothingness into being. Look down from heaven, O Master, upon those who have bowed their heads to you, for they have not bowed them down to flesh and blood, but to you, the awesome God. Therefore, O Master, make smooth the ways that lie before us all for our good, in accord with each one's personal need. Sail with the seafarers, travel with travelers, heal the sick, a physician of our souls and our bodies. Through the grace, mercies, and loving kindness of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your most holy, good, and life-giving Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Attend, O Lord Jesus Christ, our God, from your holy dwelling and from the throne of glory in your kingdom, and come to sanctify us, you who are seated on high with the Father and are invisibly present here with us. Deign to give to us with your mighty hand your most pure body and precious blood and through us to all the people. God, be merciful to me, O sinner. God, be merciful to me, O sinner. God, be merciful to me, O sinner. Let us be attentive, the holy gifts for the holy. One is holy, one is Lord, Jesus Christ. Sanctify to the glory of God the Father. Your good spirit will lead me to the land of righteousness. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. I believe, O Lord, and confess that you are truly Christ, the Son of the living God, who came into the world to save sinners of whom I am first. Accept me this day, O Son of God, as a partaker of your mystical supper. I will not tell the mystery to your enemies, nor will I give you a kiss as did Judas, but like the thief I confess to you. Remember me, O Lord, when you come into your kingdom. Remember me, O Master, when you come into your kingdom. Remember me, O Holy One, when you come into your kingdom. May the partaking of your holy mysteries, O Lord, be unto me not for judgment or condemnation, but for the healing of soul and body. God, be merciful to me, a sinner. God, cleanse me of my sins and have mercy on me. I have sinned without number. Forgive me, O Lord. Viruju, Hospode, i ispovidujo štoteje se vo istinu Hristo, sin Boha živoho, što prišel v svi trištiki v spaste, z jakih perši ja. Večeri Tvojeji tajnoji, sjohodnji Sinu Božji, me neprečasne komprime, bo v roham Tvojim tajni ne povim i po cilunku ne dam Tobi jak juda, ale jak rozbinnik spovidaju se Tobi. Pomine mene, Gospode, kole prejdeš v carstvi Tvojim. Pomine mene, Vladeko, kole prejdeš v carstvi Tvojim. Pomine mene, Svjetej, kole prejdeš v carstvi Tvojim. Nehaj ne nasudi, ne neosudženja, Bude mi ni prečastje svetih Tvojih tajn, Gospode, a na scilenje duši i tijela. Bože, milostevi, budi mi ni hrišnomu. Bože, očiste hrihe moji i pomiluj mene. Bez česla na hrišev ja, Gospode, prosti mi ni. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. God the Lord has appeared to us.
Плывет святами песня любови, на звук твой громом сотень гуда. На нас плывая счастье чудове, сам Христос Господь Услави да, на нас плывая счастье чудове, сам Христос Господь услави да. Let all creation sing out in triumph. May this song of victory everywhere resound. Christ in his glory dwells now among us, showering graces, love without bound. Christ in his glory dwells now among us, showering graces, love without bound. В мои хаты не в маленьке воти Хостить безмежне щастя любов. Сам Христос Господь, що на голготі за ріхи світу дав жертві кров. Сам Христос Господь, що на голготі за гріхи світу дав шертві кров. Living among us in a humble dwelling, There we find an ending friendship and love. Christ, Lord eternal, who in great suffering for all poor sinners poured out his blood. Christ, Lord eternal, who great suffering for all poor sinners poured out his blood. We have seen the true light. We have received the heavenly spirit. 
We have found the true faith. We worship the undivided Trinity for having saved us. Blessed be our God, always, now, and forever, and ever. Amen. May our mouths be filled with your praise, O Lord, that we may sing of your glory. For you made us worthy to partake of your holy, divine, immortal, and life-giving mysteries. Preserve us in your holiness, that we may meditate all the day upon your justice. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Prosi, prenyavši božestvenih, svetih, prečestih, nebesnih, životvornih, nebesnih, životvornih, strašnih, hristovih tajn, dostojno podjakujemo, gospode, vi. Gospode, pomilu. Zastupi, spasi, pomiluj, ochrani nas, Bože, Tvojeju blagodatju. Gospode, pomiluj. Deň je vez doskonali, svjeti i mirni, i bezrišni, vyprosivši sami sebe, jeden odno i vse žitja naše, Hristu Bohovi vidajmo. To vi, Gospode. Ďakujemo Tebi, Vladeko, čelodi, Če dobročencu duš našeg, še te i sjohodnji spodobil nas tvih nebesnih i besmetnih tajnstv, sprav našu put, skripe nas vsih v strasi tvojemu, zbereže naše žitja, skripe naši stopi, molitvami, molinjami, slavnoj Bohorodici, presnodjive Mariji i vsi svjatih tvojih, bo te je se osvjačenje naše, ime tebi slavu vasalajemo, Otcu i Senu i Svjetomu Duhovi, nini po vseh čas, i na vike vični. Amin. Let us go forth in peace. In the name of the Lord. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Hear us, O God, our Savior, hope of all the ends of the earth and of those far away at sea. On the day of Pentecost, you bestowed the promised gift upon humanity when you poured forth the visitation of the Holy Spirit in the form of fiery tongues upon your blessed disciples and apostles, showing them to be preachers and defenders of the gospel. We pray to you, fill us with joy and gladness by the coming of your Holy Spirit, that we may bless you all the days of our lives. For all good giving and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from you, the Father of lights, and we render glory, thanksgiving, and worship to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord, now and forever, now and forever, now and forever. Upon you with his grace and his love for mankind now always and forever and ever. Amen. Glory be to you, Christ God, our hope. Glory be to you. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit now and forever Amen. and ever. Amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Give the blessing. Christ, our true God, who sent the Holy Spirit in the form of fiery tongues upon his disciples and apostles, through the prayers of his Immaculate Mother, of our Father among the saints, John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, of St. Joseph at whose church this is, and of the holy martyrs, Lucilian and those with them, whom we commemorate today and of all the saints will have mercy on us and save us, for he is good and he loves mankind. Amen. Today is the first Saturday of the month of June, and as custom, 
uh, we renew our act of consecration to the Immaculate Heart of Mary. So please join me in this renewal of our consecration to her Immaculate Heart. And also, after the consecration, at the conclusion of the liturgy, um, we, um, uh, we will pray our devotion to Our Lady of Sorrows. So if you can, please uh, join us in this devotion, this beautiful devotion to Our Lady of Sorrows. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. O blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of mercy, Queen of heaven and earth, refuge of sinners, we consecrate ourselves in a very special way to your Immaculate Heart. By this act of consecration, we intend to live with you and through you all the obligations assumed by our baptismal consecration. We further pledge to bring about in ourselves that interior conversion so urgently demanded by the gospel, a conversion that will free us of every attachment to ourselves and to easy compromises with the world so that, like you, we may be available only to do always the will of the Father. And as we resolve to entrust to you, O Mother most sweet and merciful, our life and vocation as Christians, <coughs> that you may dispose of it according to your designs of salvation in this hour of decision that weighs upon the world. We pledge to live it according to your desires, especially as it pertains to a renewed spirit of prayer and penance, the fervent participation in the celebration of the Eucharist and in the works of the apostolate, the daily recitation of the Holy Rosary, and an austere manner of life in keeping with the gospel that shall be to all a good example of the observance of the law of God and the practice of the Christian virtues, especially of that of purity. We further promise you to be united with the Holy Father, with the hierarchy, with our priests, in order to thus set up a barrier to the groaning co confrontation directed against the magisterium that threatens the very foundation of the Church. Under your protection, we want, moreover, to be apostles of this sorely needed unity of prayer for love for the Church, and we pray for the Holy Father, upon whom we invoke your special protection. And lastly, insofar as it is possible, we promise to lead those souls with whom we come in contact to renewed devotion to you. Mindful that atheism has caused shipwreck in the faith to a great number of the faithful, that desecration has entered into the holy temple of God, and that evil and sin are spreading more and more throughout the world, we may be so bold as to lift our eyes trustingly to you, O Mother of Jesus, and our merciful and powerful Mother. And we invoke again today and await from you the salvation of all your children, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for your presence today, for your prayers, and joining in in this renewal of act, consecration to the Immaculate Heart of Mary. A very blessed day to everyone. Glory be to Jesus Christ. Glory be forever. Blessed are you, O Christ, our God, who revealed the fishermen as most wise by sending them the Holy Spirit. Through them you caught the entire world. Loving Master, glory to you.
Before we begin our prayers for reparation and atonement today, some announcements for you. Um, I've been asked about some additional medals of Our Lady of Sorrows and the physical chaplets. They're on their way, <clears throat> and God willing, they'll be here by the end of June. Thank you for the gifts of the chaplets I've been given. I now have two, so thank you very much. We had an excellent suggestion this week from one of the parishioners that we add special intentions for our brothers and sisters in Christ as we are gathered together to honor Mary on these Saturdays. So to make sure that we can make that happen, if you would like to print out your special intention and give it to Yvonne in the back or one of us, we'll mention it after the prayer of the Curie de Ars. And uh, just make sure that you write it out so that we can read it. We'll now start uh, with the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. The name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. The name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. The two general intentions today will be the continued uh, one for Amazon Prime streaming that terrible movie. And in the back, the uh, left side of the church, there is another streaming movie. And I warn you that this one is even more horrendous than the first. If you're interested in putting your name on the petition, the information is there. We'll start on page 15, or on the separate prayer card, the act of reparation for blasphemies against our mother of sorrows. Most glorious Virgin Mary, mother of God and our mother, turn thine eyes in pity upon us, miserable sinners. We are sorely afflicted by the many evils that surround us in this life. But especially do we feel our hearts break within us upon hearing the dreadful insults and blasphemies uttered against thee, O Virgin Immaculate, Mother of Sorrows, to which we are so frequently constrained to listen. O oh, how these impious sayings offend the infinite majesty of God and of his only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. How they provoke his indignation and give us cause to fear the terrible effects of his vengeance. Would that the sacrifice of our lives might avail to put an end to such outrages and blasphemies. Were it so, how gladly we should make it. For we desire, O Most Holy Mother, to love thee and to honor thee with all our hearts, since is, this is the will of God. And just because we love thee, we will do all that is in our power to make thee honored and loved by all men. In the meantime, do thou, O Merciful Mother, the supreme comforter of the afflicted, Accept this our act of reparation which we offer thee for ourselves and for all our families, as well as for all who impiously blaspheme thee, not knowing what they say. Do thou obtain for them from Almighty God the grace of conversion, and thus render more manifest and more glorious thy kindness, thy power, and thy great mercy. May they join with us in proclaiming thee, blessed among women, the Immaculate Virgin, and most compassionate Mother of God. We now say the angelic salutation three times. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are the fruit of your womb, for you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. A precious offering through our Blessed Mother Mary, by the Curie de Ars, St. John Vianney. O Mary, Mother of Sorrows, we beseech thee by that inexpressible tortures thou didst endure at the death of thy Son, offered to our Eternal Father in our place, Thy beloved Son, all covered with blood and wounds, for the grace of removing the hardness from the hearts of those who blaspheme you, your divine Son, and his crucifix, obtain their repentance and their conversion so that they might live. Our special attentions today for the health of Nick and Amelia, our thanks for Father Peter and the leadership he has provided to the parish, our thanks for Donna, who shows a truly strong woman, leadership that she's provided and as a team member to those who complete the tasks of the parish. 
And finally, Lord, we ask that you and your mother turn your holy face to the two children we are, who are of special concern to us. And please remember their parents who are so devoted to you and your mother. We also pray for a group of transgender individuals who have uh, decided to dress as nuns and claim to be a convent of nuns, uh, named the DC Nuns. Um, we also pray for the end of the war in Ukraine and the blasphemies being committed by Russian soldiers and Orthodox priests. And we also pray against all blasphemies committed by Protestant Christians who reject the position of Mary and the role she had in Jesus, our Lord's life, and in his kingdom. Oh my God, I am heartily sorry for having offended thee, and I detest all my sins because I dread the loss of heaven and fear the pains of hell, but most of all because they offend thee, my God, who are all good and deserving of all my love. I firmly resolve with the help of thy grace to confess my sins, to do penance, and to amend my life. Amen. The first sorrow, the prophecy of Simeon. And Simeon blessed them and said to Mary, his mother, Behold, this child is set for the fall and for the resurrection of many in Israel again, and for a sign which shall be contradicted. And thy own soul a sword shall pierce, that out of many hearts thoughts may be revealed. Holy Simeon blessed the mother and her child, looking upon Mary, he said solemnly and slowly, Thy own soul a sword shall pierce. The happy scene was changed in a moment, and Mary's heart was saddened as she pondered these prophetic words, and realized that her own little child was to suffer cruel tortures. And what made her sadness even greater was the prospect of man's coldness and ingratitude to her dear son. Let us stop and consider, have I been cold and ungrateful? Have I been the cause of Jesus' sufferings? Have I been the cause of Mary's sorrow? Because I have been guilty, I kneel at your feet, O mother of sorrows, and with contrition in my heart I say to you, O sorrowful mother who felt such deep suffering of soul at seeing my coldness and ingratitude towards your divine son, help me to understand the seriousness of my sins. Obtain for me the grace of true sorrow, I promise in the future to be more faithful to God's mercy and profit by his heavenly grace. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will is done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. <clears throat> the second sorrow of Mary is the flight into Egypt. And after they, the wise men, were departed, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared in sleep to Joseph, saying, Arise, and take the child and his mother, and flee into Egypt, and remain there until I tell thee, for it will come to pass that Herod will seek the child to destroy him. So he arose and took the child and his mother by night and withdrew into Egypt and remained there until the death of Herod. The gentle Joseph was given a message by an angel. He must take Mary and the child to Egypt. The heart of Mary was filled with fear. What if the soldiers of Herod should overtake them? How would she care for her child during the long journey? Consider Mary's sorrow greater still 
when she pondered the many times Jesus would be driven from man's soul because of sin. I pause to consider my guilt, and I say, O mother of sorrows, Herod caused you sorrow once, but oh, how many times have I brought sorrow to you when I allowed sin to drive Jesus from my heart and spent long periods of time before I invited him to return. I now repent of my sin from the bottom of my heart and plead with you, O mother of sorrows, never let me be separated from you and your divine son because of sin. My Jesus, never be exiled from me on earth, lest I be in exile from the kingdom of heaven. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew of my Savior crucified. The third sorrow the loss of Jesus in the temple. And having fulfilled the days when they returned, the child Jesus remained in Jerusalem, and his parents did not know it. But thinking that he was in the caravan, they had come a day's journey before it occurred to them to look for him among their relatives and acquaintances. And not finding him, they returned to Jerusalem in search of him. The happy group of pilgrims were returning from Jerusalem. They had come a day's journey when another sorrow came to Mary. Jesus was not in the group. Joseph and Mary went from neighbor to acquaintance to stranger, asking if they had seen him. But from each came the same answer, no. The pilgrimage moved on, and the anxious parents retracted their weary steps to Jerusalem. Am I as anxious? Do I with sorrow in my heart? Seek Jesus, if he is lost to me because of sin. O mother of sorrows, grant that I may learn from thee how to cherish the presence of Jesus in my soul. And if ever the strength of my passions or the deceits of the devil should cause me to be separated from him, teach me how, with sorrow in my soul, I may search until I find him, never to be separated from him again. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will is done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you are born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you are born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you are born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. 
Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart, each wound renew of my Savior crucified. The fourth sorrow of Mary, Mary meets Jesus on the way to Calvary. And there followed him a great multitude of people and of women who bewailed and lamented him. The hardest blow so far in her many sorrows has come to Mary. Her son, her child, is now in the hands of his enemies. He is bruised and bleeding. He is crowned with thorns. He is carrying a heavy cross, and wicked men are determined to put him to death. If men sympathize with the mother who watches her son endure great suffering without being able to help, how great our pity when we realize that we are the cause of the suffering to the son and the sorrow to her. O Holy Mother, can I express my sorrow for the agony I have caused you? I do not deserve your pity, but show your tender mercy to me and plead with your divine Son, whom I have so cruelly treated, for the gift of tears that I may weep for my sins. In future, I promise to console you by my fidelity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, and thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew of my Savior crucified. The fifth sorrow, Jesus dies on the cross. They crucified him. Note there stood by the cross of Jesus, his mother. When Jesus, therefore, had seen his mother and the disciples standing by whom he loved, he said to his mother, Woman, behold thy son. Then he said to the disciple, Behold thy mother. The cruel nails have dug deeply into his hands and feet. The cross is raised aloft, and the limp body, racked with pain, sags, causing the wounds of the hands and the feet to open wide. Mary stands looking up at the cross until she knows that her son no longer lives, but has surrendered his spirit to his eternal Father. O mother of sorrows, I so often refuse to take up my cross and in all ways endeavor to avoid these those slight sufferings which the Lord, for my good, is pleased to send me. Obtain for me, I pray thee, that I may see clearly the value of sufferings and may be enabled to bear meekly all my crosses and trials. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will is done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you are born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you are born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you have born Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. The sixth sore of Mary, Mary receives the dead body of Jesus in her arms after he is pierced with the lance. Joseph of Arimathea, a noble counselor, came and went boldly to Pilate and begged the body of Jesus. And Joseph, buying fine linen and taking him down, wrapped him up in the fine linen. Consider the most bitter sorrow which pierced the soul of Mary as she held the dead body of Jesus in her arms. The flesh torn with deep wounds is covered with blood. John, Mary Magdalene, and Nicodemus, her companions, who stayed with her to comfort and console, were of little assistance, for they too were prostrate with grief. Shall I remain unmoved when all are touched with grief? Shall I alone be tearless when all are moved with pity? I, who by my sins have caused all this suffering, pray for me, O Holy Mother of God, that I may weep for my sins. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through, in my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. The seventh sorrow, Jesus is placed in the sepulcher. Now there was in the place where he was crucified a garden, and in the garden a new sepulcher, where no man had been laid. Therefore, because of the Jewish preparation day, they laid Jesus, for the sepulcher was nigh at hand. Our grief over the death of a loved one is more acute at the moment when the casket is lowered in the grave than at any other time. For now, death seems so final, the separation so complete. What then was the sorrow of Mary as she gazed for the last time at the lifeless body of her son as the great stone was rolled forward to seal the door of the sepulcher? Mary, most holy virgin and queen of martyrs, accept the sincere homage of my love. With you, O sorrowful virgin, I will gladly suffer all the trials, sufferings, and afflictions which it shall please our Lord to send me. Have pity on me, sweet mother. Reconcile me to your divine son, Jesus. Keep me always in his grace and assist me at the hour of my death so that I may keep you in, meet you in heaven and sing your praises forever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will is done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Rejoice, Mother God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. 
for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, for you have borne Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. To remember and honor the tears that Mary shed during the passion of Jesus, we recite the angelic salutation three times. Rejoice, Rejoice Mother of God, God, Virgin Mary, Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. Rejoice, Mother of God, Virgin Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. For you gave birth to Christ, the Savior and Redeemer of our souls. On page 12, the concluding prayer. O God, at whose passion is foretold by Simeon, a sword of sorrow pierced the most sweet soul of the glorious Mary, Virgin and Mother. Grant in thy mercy that we who honor the memory of her sorrows may gain the happy fruit of thy passion, who livest and reignest with God the Father in the unity of the Holy Ghost, world without end. Amen. Prayer for a happy death. Let intercession be made for us, we beseech thee, O Lord Jesus Christ, now and at the hour of our deaths, before the throne of thy mercy, by the Blessed Virgin Mary, thy mother, whose most holy soul was pierced by a sword of sorrow in the hour of thy bitter passion. O Jesus Christ, Savior of the world, who with the Father and the Holy Ghost livest and reignest world without end, amen. Our Lady of a happy death, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. For our sick relatives and friends, O Queen of Martyrs and Mother of Consolation, by that sword of sorrow which pierced thy soul when thou didst see thy Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, raised upon the cross, pierced with nails and covered with his own blood, pray for all these sick people. Here mention the sick people you would like to pray for in silence. that they all may by thy powerful intercession be cured of their illnesses, and thus we may both in time and eternity give thee heartfelt thanks. Amen. St. Bonaventure's Prayer to the Mother of Sorrows. O sorrowful virgin, unite me at least to the humiliations and wounds of thy son, so that both he and thee may find comfort in having someone sharing thy sufferings. O how happy I would be if I could do this for is there perhaps anything greater, sweeter, or more advantageous for a person? Who I, why dost thou not grant me what I ask? If I have offended thee, be just and pierce my heart. If I have been faithful to thee, leave me not without a reward. Give me thy sorrows. In reparation to our Lord, we will now recite the golden arrow prayer, which is at the front, which he wrote and gave to St. Maria Perina. The Golden Arrow Prayer. May the most holy, most sacred, most adorable, most incomprehensible and utterable name of God be always praised, blessed, loved, adored and glorified in heaven, on earth and under the earth by all the creatures of God and by the sacred heart of our Lord Jesus Christ in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Amen. Thank you for joining your voices in the prayers of reparation. May God richly bless you, yours, your friends, and your families now and forever. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen.